I think Toad has always been underrated. He's not been popular enough. So let's fill this in. We don't need to fill this in solidly, it can just be a couple of layers and that will be enough for now I think, so let's do that. Probably going to end up stripping some trees down if we run out of uh, leaves which at the rate we're going we probably are one there okay that's better so let's get a couple of layers in here uh won't zombies and stuff spawn inside it no they won't because what i'm planning on doing is actually putting a, a, some lights inside it uh, Dash Nicole, hello. Um, but yeah, good, good point. Right, so what I'm going to do here is just chuck some torches in here. They won't set fire to anything, and they'll just add a bit of illumination to the tree. There we go. That will solve that problem. Ah, okay, so what I'm thinking here, okay, is I'm going to go three layers up and I'm going to go in one, three layers up and I'm going to go in one, three layers up and I'm going to go in one, and carry on until we meet in the middle. And then I'm going to come back and, and roughen it up a little bit. So this is the third layer. fairly quickly get to where we want to be. We don't have to worry about plummeting anymore because there's ladders. That, that's, that's three. So the next set is going to do gonna be like this that one yeah that one that. <laughs> tree party with cake and Damien it's all going to end well it's probably all going to end in arson to be honest with you but uh, oh, good luck oh, I was wondering when that was going to happen So we'll put this layer on, as you can see. This is going to take a little while to do, I'm afraid, but it's probably going to be worth it. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha. 
William, you've been a very naughty boy, and this is your chance to ponder upon your stupidity. I mean, let's face it, there is no wrath like an Ellen scorn. My only real worry is one day we are going to find out what was uh, the real reason why Ellen's been leaving it early in the morning and it's probably going to be far more boring than anything we've made up. So what I say is we ignore it and just carry on thinking about the, uh, the Ellen homicide plan. Dear, we're going through these leaves at quite a rate of knots. Hmm. Ellen is basically evil. Yeah, forget Santa. She's just basically evil. Right, um, but. She's been made that way by other people. You know, she's been pushed. She's been pushed and pushed and pushed. And until the end I had to snap. She couldn't take it anymore. It was just, just so wrong. Everyone was out to get me. Nobody liked me. Nobody I could really trust. I mean, even Tallulah. Look at Tallulah. She, she left the door open. Somebody stole my underwear. It's just totally wrong. How can I trust people like that? It's just not good. It's just not, just not right. So, you know. Ellen, Ellen has been has been driven to the state. Um, from our point of view, it's a great thing, but you know, it's gonna it's gonna lead to a massacre that's gonna cause even hey, it's gonna cause even Mrs. Potsdam to sober up. Yeah, that's exactly what I think. I think you know the bra incident was just you know sort of one humiliation too many. Right, we have to do this the hard way, are we? Okay. Let's do it the hard way, then. And as everyone knows, the hard way starts with people eating. Uh, that's what I want. Oh, thod you. There we go. See you're out to get me. That's right. There. See so you fall off that. <laughs> no, Ellen's not Draco Malfoy. Draco Malfoy, to be totally honest with you, is a privileged little parts boy who actually has no idea of dealing how to deal with his power. Ellen is, you know, Ellen could well be the the person that Draco Malfoy thinks that he should be. You know the the. The, the the super genius schemer, um, the guy with all the real ideas. I mean, they're about respected the same, I would say. And to be totally honest with you, of the two of them, I think that Draco Malfoy is actually far more feminine. So, no, it doesn't work. Yeah. 
<laughs> How are we doing? I think this is probably going to narrow in a little bit too fast, but I'm still think it's going to be all right. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, we can have a party in the Christmas tree with cake. Why the heck not? Uh, build this up a little bit more. Try not to miss too often. At least it's getting quicker as this is getting smaller. Oak leaves, acacia leaves, our last set of spruce leaves. Wow, we do this for about an hour already. Uh, yeah, um, <laughs> I can see Frankie, well, I think a one-track mind is a bit of an understatement there. Mm. Oh, there we are, we're all done with those. Uh... I can sympathize with that to an extent. Well, I'm not going to be doing much for Christmas. It's my birthday in a week's time, and um, we tend to go and eat out for that one. I, I did. I enjoyed it immensely at the time, but afterwards I'm thinking, yeah, okay, that was nice, but I think we're going to stay in the house for the next three weeks just to get over it. More spruce leaves. Get rid of those. No. Well, glad to hear that, Andy, because, you know, life gets a little bit pointless otherwise. So let's get back up here. There we go. What now? What are we doing? Are we doing... Yes, we are. So we don't actually need that one. Um, what we want is one here. <laughs> yeah, I suppose it's one way of looking at it, isn't it? Congratulations, you have reached level 43. Mm, got a roll. Alright, okay. Yes. And the worst thing is, without having my son around, who used to take perverse pleasure in telling me exactly how old I was, you know, occasionally I've got to go and look it up. Hmm. 
Yeah, that's slightly wrong. Take one out there. One out there. That'll do. Okay, and the last set will just be right up against the tree here. Like this. <laughs> oh, my mother has been 29 for well actually to be totally honest with you, I won't say how many years I don't think she listens to this but she has a spice everywhere so if my mother can be 29 for well a couple of years let's put it that way why not Okay, let's go down a couple of levels there, and then we want some more ladders so we can still get to the top. There we go. <laughs> There's somebody dicing with death. Okay, let's have a quick look at this from the outside. I don't think it's going to look quite right, but it's probably going to do. And we will tighten it up in a little bit. No, I was worried about that. It's actually in the wrong place now looking at it. Well, not that I'm going to move it, but uh, Slimy Claws uh, blocks too much of it. Let's see what it looks like from this angle. Mm, I like the design. I think it's good. Let's stick a... Right, let's start sticking some decorations on that. So let's go and get some bits and pieces. Uh, some glowstones, some jack-o'-lanterns. We're going to make, want to make a star at the top. Uh, let's go and see what we've got. Yeah, you see Bill and Ted are suddenly so pleased to see me. Because I'm holding food. Uh, such a fickle thing affection. Pick these in here for now. We're not going to need them immediately. I'll sort those out later on. Right, let's just keep a few just in case. Right, coloured glass. Some reds, got some limes. Uh, I guess we can chuck a few yellows up. And. Bow stone. <laughs> Sounds like an interesting person. Some of them. Uh, and what else do I want? What do I, oh, I might as well get some jack o' lanterns while I'm at it, haven't I? Okay. Do some stuff with this. flat at the top so let's start with that see if we can get that right <laughs> 